Hello, I'm Gary with HaveFunWithScience.com and today I have a question for you. What do you think would happen if you take two common everyday items such as yeast and 3% hydrogen peroxide and mix them together? Let's find out. So why does all this gooey mess form when I add three packets of dry yeast to four ounces of hydrogen peroxide? Well, it has to do with the yeast. You see, the yeast has this enzyme in it called catalase. And catalase, when added to hydrogen peroxide, breaks it down or makes it decompose. A scientist would call hydrogen peroxide H2O2 because hydrogen peroxide on a molecular level is comprised of two hydrogen atoms and two oxygen atoms, hence H2O2. However, when you add the enzyme catalase from the yeast to it, it breaks the hydrogen peroxide down into water and oxygen. So let's pretend you have one molecule of hydrogen peroxide in this hand and another molecule of hydrogen peroxide in this hand. So I would have an H2O2 in this hand and another H2O2 in this hand. When I add the catalase, from the yeast to the hydrogen peroxide, it would break this down so I would no longer have two hydrogen peroxide molecules. Instead, I would have an H2O, another H2O, and an O2. In other words, I would have two water molecules and one oxygen molecule. For additional clarity, I also have this explanation in text. One more thing, I noticed when I was cleaning up the jar that I did the experiment in, that when I combined the yeast and the hydrogen peroxide together, that it caused an exothermic reaction. In other words, it produced heat. Have a good day and have fun.